Hello? Okay. Um, so, uh, my name is Silva Rapi. I work as an IT governance specialist for the municipality of Tirana. And today I'm going to talk about us using Nextcloud as a collaboration software uh, for a year now at the municipality. Um, a few words about the municipality of Tirana. Uh, it is the biggest municipality of Albania. Tirana is also the capital of the country. The city has a population of over 800,000 citizens. Uh, we are over 1,500 employees. And uh, the offices are located in different parts of the town with uh, 13 directorates which are divided in smaller units and we have 24 administrative units to which are depended by the municipality. Um, so what were the challenges that the IT staff was facing before deciding to implement a collaboration platform such as Nextcloud? Um, one of the issues that I mentioned earlier is the fact that the offices are placed in different locations and the employees need to interact over the time, need to exchange files, and um, some of them have like very sensitive data on them, so we needed a very secure platform who we could trust before deploy the solution. Uh, and also uh, to facilitate this kind of collaboration between the employees. Uh, we also needed a way for better ways to recover the data since most of the staff was constantly asking the IT staff, uh, well, they would delete files, they needed to recover them, and this would uh, cost us a lot of time to, in order to, to support all of them, and we needed better ways to perform backups. So a uh, file share and sync solution would solve most of these issues, and Nextcloud would solve all of them. Um, this is like one of the main reasons why we deployed it. So um, why Nextcloud? When you decide to uh, invest on a new platform uh, for your IT infrastructure, there are a few factors or reasons that you take into consideration, such as like the cost, the updates you take, the support you get from the company behind it, etc., etc. So uh, some of the reasons why we decided to proceed with a Nextcloud was the fact that um, the Nextcloud was having continuous updates with a lot of apps being added all all over the time. Um, it would offer better features uh, and, of course, the special focus on security and the data privacy that um, it was having. Also, one of the main reasons was the fact that um, Nextcloud is a 100% open source platform. The municipality during the last year has been following an op open source approach in the IT solutions it is making. Uh, one, uh, Nextcloud is one of them. Now we are under a migration into LibreOffice and switching from Microsoft Office and also using Thunderbird um, as an email client just to mention a few. Um, and also, uh, the, least, um, the last but not the least, is the fact that Nextcloud has a very active community behind where we could like report to issues and uh, get updates uh, really fast. Uh, about the technical implementation, the municipality of Tirana has its own data center where we host all of the platforms and the Nextcloud server also is being run this way. Um, so it, it was uh, last summer that we went through the migration to Nextcloud. Currently, we have 1,200 users. Uh, more will be integrated soon through Active Directory, so th these numbers will grow, and in a daily basis we have over uh, 450 users. 
Some of the most apps currently that we are using are Rainloop, Collabora Online, the Nextcloud Talk, which it's good to hear that it's having a lot of improvements in the future, Calendar, Contact Circles, and Notes. Uh, but also many other apps are activated, but those are the ones which are like mostly used. Um, so um, the municipality of Tirana has like an average age of uh, over 45 of the employees, and most of them are not like they tend to fear a bit technology are not very familiar. So when we um, decided to go uh, and use uh, Nextcloud as a collaboration platform, uh, people tend to fear to fear that and uh, wouldn't explore most of the features, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So one way we found to solve this problem was to organize different training sessions where we would explain how easy it was to to use it and how it facilitate their work in a daily basis. Uh, it went quite well. We had a lot of participants during those sessions, also people who like were very familiar with the product but would, were curious to learn more about what could have done with Nextcloud. And some of the feedback we get was that the platform was very uh, easy to use. It was a safer way to exchange files and documents uh, since like more than a year ago, people would still exchange documents with uh, USB sticks, etc. cetera. Um, so uh, the future plans was we are developing an e-learning platform with Moodle and we hope to integrate that via Nextcloud. We have a special focus and are trying to motivate our users to use uh, Collabora online and we also plan to use Federation uh, in the future. Thank you all. <laughs>